What's going on YouTube? In today's video, I want to go over the big three towing mods you'll need for your 99 to 06 GM truck. So this is going to be Tahoe, Suburbans, Yukons, Yukon Excels, even, if, even a few of your Silverados, and Sierra. So this is going to help all my GM truck guys slash SUV guys. I've been towing a little bit with my truck. As you can see, I got a lot of stuff I've been here to drop off. So um, I got a bulletproof hitch, which is extreme overkill for everything that I do. But that's not a part of this video. So let's get into the video. So the first mod I'm gonna recommend is gonna be upgraded brakes. So for most of my GM guys from 99 to 06, you either have some small single pistons in the front or you may have some small dual pistons if you want to tow heavier if you're if you're going to tow near or heavier than the tow capacity then the first thing you need to do is to go ahead and upgrade those brakes to the 08 at least at the minimum upgrade to the 08 plus tahoe brakes so just upgrade to the next gen brakes they bolt right up there's no you buy the brakes pads rotors and they bolt right up there's no there's nothing extra that you need to do. You just need to make sure that they're going to fit with the rims that you're running them with. So first thing is going to be upgraded brakes. And that's currently what I'm running. I'm running the 08 Plus. I'm running the 08 um, two-piston calipers. And I have the StopTech. I had a StopTech Extreme Truck and Tow rotors with those uh, rotors and pads. So uh, these, this truck breaks like a car now and it breaks just as good as my infinity which is crazy to say so huge upgrade um, and I definitely recommend it if you're going to be towing near or over the tow capacity so like I when I tow with this I don't even feel that with these brakes I haven't I've towed probably this and that just you right there haven't felt it at all feels doesn't feel like much of a difference when I tow so First upgrade is gonna be brakes. Um, second one on the list is gonna be dealing with cooling. Well, the last two are gonna be dealing with cooling. So the second thing, which is gonna be just as important as the brakes, is gonna be getting yourself a transmission cooler. Um, transmission, the 4L60, if you, if you have a truck with a 4L60 or a 4L80, you'll know that if you're towing near the tow capacity, that's one of the limiting factors, period. Like the the transmission, they come with a cooler, but if you live in a warmer climate like Texas or if you're towing near or over the tow capacity, it's more than likely going to heat up first. So uh, the transmission transmission cooler is definitely needed. I have one I'm going to put up there, uh, put on up there. I, have, I bought a True Cool, so for y'all that are wondering if I'm going to do that, yes, I am. So uh, transmission cooler is definitely something that you need to do before you even think about towing at or over your tow capacity. Some people do it, but I wouldn't, you know, I just don't want to risk blowing my transmission up or overheating it. Yeah. So let's get on to the last, very last but not least thing. And these are all important. Um, so from all of my 1500 guys and some of my 2500 guys with GM SUVs and trucks, the last thing is going to be the electric fan upgrade. So, so the electric fans came on, I believe the 2500s starting in 04 maybe. That upgrade is not only gonna free up some horsepower, probably free up 10, 15, 20 horsepower for the truck because it's not working to turn the fan, but it also gives you higher cooling capability, which means that your truck not only has more power, 
but it also has better cooling. So this is a huge upgrade too. Um, this will help you. This will help increase your tow capacity along with the other two mods. So uh, Tahoe's are very capable trucks. You know, all of them really. They're all very capable towing vehicles. For my guys out there that want to know if you can tow with these trucks, you can. Just do those three upgrades and that will save you a lot of time and a lot of money in the future. So that's going to be it for this video. I'm going to be making more videos about what you should do towing upgrade wise and towing mods you should do so y'all stay tuned for that but for now i'm gonna unload all of this stuff that i threw in this u-haul trailer and yeah i'll have more videos coming on this so hope y'all enjoyed the video if you did drop a like comment below what you think and as always y'all take it easy subscribe to my channel if you have not already I am dropping videos daily and I'm dropping good content daily so don't miss out. Make sure you subscribe because most of y'all that are watching this video have not subscribed. So as, as always y'all take it easy and I will catch you on the next video.